Welcome back to the second video of the day. This is Summoner's Wars on Villa Sync. And this is the second video of the day and also the second recording. Because the first one, the game kind of took a shit on itself. It's kind of got really laggy, kind of fucked up a little bit. So, I threw stuff on her. Keep in mind it's not going to be the, um, not the final build. But if it works... It might stay for a while now. Gave her some attack. She's now quicker than she's maybe gonna go third. Which might be okay. Um good crit rate. Some accuracy, but also accuracy on her uh artifacts. And that's the crit damage that she's got, and it's it is what it is. Um subject to change. I can't get her in rage, even if I go for an intangible set. But the fact of the matter is, apart from, uh, apart from, we did, so she's got a pretty good, we need Ergar. I think we need to put Ergar, we'll take, she's got the same, Aura, I believe, as uh, she does. We need him. Uh, we need her. I don't have a star. Um, no. I want to go for him. Oh, we're going to need, do we need crow? Possibly. <sighs> Keeping in mind, I have zero idea if this is actually going to work. But it's going to, we're going to try it. Well, then we'll try steel fortress and then we'll try Punisher's Crypt. But I've seen her used in like a lot of comps. Uh, this is Water Cannon Girl. And it's advised not to awaken her. She's built for Necro. And for now, it's all she will genuinely go into is Necro. So let's test. Let's go boss battle, uh, attack order, boss, boss, boom. I don't want to waste time on fucking golems and shit. Um, we need to make sure we're staying alive, we're recycling cooldowns, and we're just fucking people up. I don't know if it's going to work though. I think the build for a water cannon girl is too crap. But, oh yeah, I think it possibly is. So, are we too early game that she has to have HP? Because it very well is possible. <laughs> Hello, so imprisoned soul, who are you taking? Oh, don't kill anybody. Team up immunity, do that, decrease defense, broke the shield. Oh no, you're going to kill someone. See, that's not nice. To be fair, there's getting... Uh, I was getting fucked over a table. That's pretty much it. So does she need more HP? What if we just say fuck Necro and we try... I want to see what happens here. I'm not interested in using him. We'll keep him... <laughs> I want to utilize 
eight hits. Or you at least want to give her a go. Or no, actually, I needed Shaman for Necro, so yeah. I possibly put in the wrong team, but it doesn't exchange the fact that, yeah, we lost. And she's unawakened for her multi hits. Let's see how she gets on. Relatively annoying. Heart will. Halfway through the build, the game messes up. I then can't remember all the runes I put on her. Which is a bit crap. Um, but yes, I think she needs more HP. We did increase her speed, but... I'm trying to think if there's any point realistically... Focusing too much on speed in Necro, because he limits your speed anyway. It makes no fucking difference. Dude, you just fucking healed. So, come on. I need you to stop healing. Uh, I'm pretty... Lauren might be good here, actually. Because one of these... What tower... Which, which one of these is healing you? No, I mean, well, we were victorious. Uh, whether it's going to be... Ironclad? Is another story. Let's just sell it. Fuck it, yeah, well... Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Alright, who the hell did we just use... We used Ergar, we used... Not you, you suck. Not you. We used the Dalgi. I think we used another Dalgi. We used another Dalgi. We got a lot of doggies. So let's get on. I mean, if I need to use shaman, I will. I feel like we we can at least punish her crypt and steel fortress. We can easily do. A best. We've got to find the right combination. I feel like we can do the exact same in spiritual realm where we can you know do our best dungeons there as well. Uh, yeah so let's see how we get on. I don't have a star. She seems to be one of those champions that seems to work really well. And if, uh, what do you call her, if blue hair keeps dying, then it might be kind of irrelevant having her here in the first place. Unless we get life drain on her artifacts. Which I'm not, I'm not adverse to. I think he, does this little fucker heal like 10% or something? Oh, so what? So, oh, okay, so it goes to five, he drops a thunderbolt. Unrecoverable would be quite handy, yeah, so. I cannot see us managing to defeat him on this. We're definitely going to need unrecoverable. Which in itself has gave me an idea. Maybe building the blue chick was a waste of time, but that's why we have to 
that's why we have to test these things. Uh, da -da 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 -da. We need you. Yeah. She will have unrecoverable, so we'll also stop him taking a turn. Which doesn't matter. The only thing that matters is he has unrecoverable. And then, yeah, if he doesn't take a turn, then the buff, the debuff shouldn't fall off. <laughs> My logic might be a bit off, but yeah, it's time, time will tell. We're taking, we're taking the dogs out for a walk. <laughs> and we're just fucking seeing how it goes. But this is a bit hard. If we can do normal on a very like easy, consistent basis, then I'm okay with it. You can screw that fucking shield. Come on, Lauren, do your... There you go. So he cannot recover. Fuck all. Are we, ooh, are we quick enough to stop him taking a turn? Lauren is over 200 speed, so... Okay. I feel like we need to do this in the background 10 times or so. I feel like we need to. Uh, we're, we're also bloody close to getting... Uh, well, that's not nice to put into chat, is it, you twat? Uh, fucking hell, I've got a new best time as well. Steel Fortress a bit hard. Doggies and Lauren and stuff. Right, well, I want to go... Let's do this here. Da -da -da -da. So I want to check the events tab. Um, Necropolis will always just be a fucking pain. Uh, are you still pooping? Well, I hope. Maybe not. Let's test it on 10. If we die, then... It is what it is. I want to see how much... I'm short of 1300. Because you've got the extra shop that you can select dragon and all that stuff in. And I want to fucking know 1240, so we're 60 away. Uh, hidden. So yeah, we've got to attack him. I think that's cleared as it is. Her special shop, yes. It's just what it is. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Well, a thousand sixty. Uh, what does this mean? <laughs> Dragon Slayer rune set fix. This is an item that allows you to select one type of rune obtained. Okay, yeah, so, yeah, so effectively I can do that pick speed and I can have at it. Well, yeah, that's fucking good. And we're getting close, we're like 1200 plus, I want to get to 13, get that. That's like one of my main things right now, I want that fucking, I really, 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 really want to just knock out some uh, I really want to knock out some fucking, what do you call it, Witcher tokens. Uh, her, I thought I thought her build did kind of fucking suck in all fairness. Uh, violent is kind of irrelevant, but I quite like it, but still. Um... We've got damage, HP is in 8. Uh, we've got that. I may see, I mean I could, I could potentially put HP percentage, but I just don't know if I like it. 
I like that. I'm just not a fan of this, I don't think. Okay. Don't know what she's talking. That ain't bad either. Speed could be an issue. I have no idea of what speed is. There's no crit damage there. Uh, there's also no HP. I put off. Obviously, it's there. So, yeah, her build first time around. I mean, I'll leave it up to the experts in the comments section. Uh, to let me know just how bad it is. Because, yeah, I genuinely do want to know. I want to know the aspects that I can improve. They would be cool because it's always good to improve and try and make yourself a little bit better than... So I've got the light to Yennefer. The wind Yennefer, sorry. Wind. Yeah, and it's her, I think, that skills for her could be fucking really good. And if I choose to go over her, I, th I believe maybe I need to work on the skills. Um, so Ergar's got his skills done, so does Lauren. I don't think I can do... His skills because he's currently being used. I might be wrong, but I don't think so. Uh, like Crow, I could use Devil Mons and shit, which might be okay. Now, hopefully, all is good there. So, when I wake up in the morning, um, because I want to make sure I get this fucking Witcher scroll. It means we can just summon it and see what we get from it. Um, guaranteed a five star. It would be really sick to get a blessing. Because you'd get, you should get two Witcher chance to choose from. Which to be fair would be a lot worse than probably one. So I, pro I probably won't do that. that. That sounds actually like way worse. Oh uh, yeah, complete. Right, so can we do normal then? I'll happily do normal. If uh, I'll happily do normal if we can get knock out fucking ten in a row. Uh, this one. <laughs> I think that she needs to not be there. I think I was supposed to take Aikaru. Uh, that goes there. I don't think he was there either. Now I can't remember the team. I'm for some reason thinking of the Necro team. So I need to try Shaman. I swear my memory is fucking totally just disappearing. <laughs> Punisher's crypt, so oh Lauren, that's what it was. So even if I do normal just now, it's a slight improvement. If I can get it consistent, I'll be kinda chuffed. Uh I'm trying to think of I don't Maybe Ergar could potentially go in there. We do need to remove, I think. We need to remove someone for Lauren there. So yeah, I think it never worked purely because I was using the wrong champions. So let's go back. Let's stick with 
I don't care about the speed. Well, actually, do I? Maybe I, maybe I do care about the speed. Maybe I do. Now this issue is, uh, the main fucking issue is here. If we're, oh, if it's Lauren, let's try it. Was it Rauk and Crow? Um, again, I'll be honest, I cannot fucking remember. I think Ikaru has to be in the team because he pulls everybody in. Therefore, he enables so much damage. Yeah, so... Uh, let's see. We'll see how we get on with that. We'll see how we get on having Verd, and then we'll try it on normal. Uh, let's just watch, see how it gets on. I think I'd probably be better having Aikaru. <laughs> Time will tell. Oh, come on, can we go full screen here? Yeah. As long as she can remove that fucking shield, we're fine. Right, attack, 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 attack. Unrecoverable, yes. Uh, I, mean, I mean, he... Is it necessarily? I think having him here is a bit of a mistake. If it wins, it's going to be way fucking slower though. I just don't. It's possible. I could be wrong. It possibly could be consistent, but. I mean, I kind of think it might not be. So why don't we just watch this and see how it goes. It's interesting that I started and I was going to just piss around the neck roll, but if we can do a different dungeon, that's fine. If it's normal, it's a start. If it doesn't involve water cannon girl, then... It just doesn't involve her. I was hoping it would, but the build might be lackluster. We're going to see. I don't think we're quick enough to stop him from getting that shield, but it doesn't really make a fucking huge difference. We can remove it. Uh, like heal block. Yeah, I mean, it's going to take slightly longer. The more he drops lightning bolts. Let's get rough. Yeah, so we're going to have to... Interesting fact that I mentioned earlier. That another company wants to talk to me, so... There's been three or so companies that have wanted to talk to me and whatnot, which is quite interesting. The question might be, which one do I go with now? I'm trying to think. This team may work. I kind of miss Aikaru. I don't think I need Crow. Um... I'm tempted to, after this few runs, put uh, Aikaru in instead of Crow. And therefore, we can hopefully pull in Lauren to work her cooldowns uh, to stop this fucking healing bullshit from the boss. Take all her moves 
Black Car cooldowns a little bit. But to be fair, we maybe don't need Verda Hyle here either. Um, you will boost stuff up, but I think for the floor that we're on just now, this has to be a winning combination. Uh, so. We one minute seven is not too shabby. I mean, I'll take progress as it comes. Uh, let's do that. Yeah, and we're just going to get some Witcher tokens. I'm in love with that. I'll take them all day. Guild stuff to do. I'll do it soon. Not long. Do the arena. The dailies are finished. Uh, so what do we have? Four LDs, thirteen mysticals. They're building up as well. Although I have spent probably five hundred or so on energy, along with along with stored energy, and um, we've got a set load of engraved summon pieces, which of course I do. And I think I may have a champion here that I'm going to take out soon. I may be wrong, Mav, possibly, but not soon. The one I'm looking for, the gargoyle could be pretty good, let's be honest. It's an LD just waited to happen. I mean, yeah, we're, we're winning, 4 out of 10. So what we may have to do is we'll just say to try the combination, we'll take out Verd, we'll put Ikaru back in, which then instead of a tack bar, Ikaru guarantees a turn. And maybe that's just better overall. Yeah, but I think it's safe to say that we even if we lose someone, we're still going to kick some ass. We're still going to win. And steal Fortress Normal. Punisher's Crypt, I think this team possibly... Um, apart from Lauren, maybe. Lauren will, I think, trigger him to take a turn. So maybe if we put, because what is he doing? I mean, the slow goes up. So if you put, well, he'll, to be fair, Ergar will have block buffs, essentially. So that's handy enough. We might be fucking okay, like. We might be fine. We may be a-okay. Twelve fifty-five. yeah, so pretty much I'll do dungeons, we'll get to 1300 then yeah, we're going to be definitely well, it's 145 star, it's a shame I thought it was 5 stars only even if it's a 4 star it's, it's good to get a collab champion regardless so at least that's pretty cool. Never necessarily worked out with um, Cannon Girl and I'm bloody exhausted and I'm kind of half asleep. So I may, yeah, I'll tell you what, I think if it looks like that team works for this, what we'll do is end because I don't think we're I think we're going to win that every fucking time to be fair sometimes it'll vary if we don't have unrecoverable but I don't see us losing it um, 
I want to go to Punisher's Crypto though, if I'm being totally honest. With the same team, pretty much apart from Lauren, Lorraine, and do we take speed or do we take damage? Speed, damage, speed, damage, speed. Uh, we'll try. See how we get on. Second of February already. Uh, we need to go into here. We need to go into boss battle real quick. No motherfucker. Boss battle. Boss. Boss. So if we lose Crow, it is what it is. If he gets to the boss then he dies, hopefully we're still able to fucking do it without much issue. Because Crow's build technically could improve, we could always try. Because you know that motherfucker is going to get a speed. <laughs> the unrecoverable would be quite handy, but the issue is. Yeah, the boss will fall off, so we need to make sure uh, we get. See, I'm you to decrease defense. Come on, people. I mean, he's got Brandon. Oh, see, the issue is. I'm curious as to whether. Yeah, I'm curious as to whether Lauren might actually be worth trying. Right. Let's just end on now. Let's save the dignity of the dog. What team did we use last time? Profile. What team did we use last time? So I think we got lucky. I think everything lined up fucking nice and smooth. Again, the issue is... I think unrecoverable is quite good, but... If he takes a turn... The boss fall... The D-boss fall off. Hmm... It was never the plan wasn't Punisher's crypt anyway, so at least we can say that it's not a total loss because it was never part of the fucking plan anyway. So one, two, you can piss off and all. <coughs> I think we need you. We need Rocky Boy. Uh, do we? We need. Hold on a minute. To be fair, maybe we didn't. Maybe we don't need. Um, Do we take Shaman then? That just do you think this will work? I'm proper curious because I think what I can and get on the build is possibly what lets her down. 
And I can't really awaken her because it'll ruin the whole, you know, it will ruin that champion as a whole, especially because uh, I need to, I need to try her in here with Shaman, so I'm trying to think if we should just remove Rauk. I'm going to have to look at a couple of builds and see how they've built their water iconic. So this could be a work in progress. Steel Fortress, I mean, if we're if we have a consistent team, it's better than a, it's better than fucking nothing. But yeah, we're back. Oh, okay, yeah. Now I know why. Now I know why this is working so well. I'm a bloody moron. I don't care. You know what? Defeated. Yeah, because we should have went to. We should have went to here, and we should have went. No, not to trial of ascension. We should have went to there. We should have went to there. We should have went to there. We should have went with the birdie, 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 shaman. A little bit of healing, big bit of damage. Hopefully the dogs look pretty good. I did think to myself at the very start, you never took anybody. So yeah, this is just necro ten. This is not what I'm looking for. So again, if we can do normal on this one, we got a couple of runs that looks okay. Depending on when he has his moves available, will be an issue. But considering team up, team up, uh, is he on violent? I don't think so. It shouldn't be that hard getting his moves back. But this is going to be the test. Can we get the champion back? Can we do enough damage? Can we, you know, will we get a will we get oblivion put on us? Because that is the issue. There's really no telling if we're going to be able to even get Rauk back. <coughs> Because if he exploits a soul, yep, so effectively no, we cannot, there's still something off with this dungeon. There's still something off, he keeps getting turns. Uh, yeah, so he's stealing all my people. So Lauren, should we use Lauren then? Do we... Is all the dogs, so do we just take out... Who's a useless piece of shit? Um, who's a useless little asshole? Him, maybe? Well, he ain't useless, but composition-wise, let's see. Ergar, I think, is good for healing. Lauren should be good enough to a degree. God, I'm heavens to Betsy, I'm tired. So yeah, we'll try a few runs here. If it fails, it's not all bad. It's it's a work in progress. It could be the build, it's gonna be the runes. If I need I'll try and grind if I need it to. Or if I just need to get like whatever I need to get, I'll see if I can get it. But yeah, fun comes first. Everything else just kinda comes in its own time. 
If we fail, we fail. If we succeed, we succeed. I think we're going to fail, but it fucking is what it is. I think we're up shit creek without a fucking paddle, to be totally honest. What if on the dungeon boss we just don't fucking... Yeah, what if we just... Okay, yeah, so I want to restart though. I want to restart and then maybe not target the boss. I think that's where we're going wrong. I think we'll have to let it just naturally naturally take place. I think that's what it is. I think that's the winning ticket. Apart from my room builds. So let's see. Damage is a fucking complicated game plus this is one of the dungeons. Oh god I hate fucking Necro. It's such a drag on my existence and my life and my happiness and everything I stand for. It's such a fucking pain in the ass. Fucking hate this dungeon. No, 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 no. No, you're fucking stupid. No, attack order. Mid boss, yes. Why are you not attacking the mid boss first? When you get to the end boss, then we're going to let everything kind of naturally flow. Because I need to get my imprisoned fucking soul back. I need, I need to also get there in the first place. So can we kill somebody please? For Christ's sake. Can we fucking kill someone? Also, Rauk might be... Rauk might not be any use uh, disappearing. We might fucking need him. Stop it. Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. Come on. Yeah, but I wait till... Who are we losing next? Because we're losing someone. We have not attacked the dog once. One would have thought by now, yeah, now this is just not working. So yeah, as much as I cannot stand Necro, I'm just going to do 10 because literally I'd rather hang from a noose than waste too much time here. If it ain't working, it ain't working. I'll just do... Punisher's Crypt Steel Fortress. We're, if we're onto something with there, if we're onto something with that, it's maybe something we need to look at. I don't know if. Um, if we go to hard. Right, so we've got. Verda Heil in the other one. Uh, question is, do we use the T from 10? The normal, sorry. Does he make a huge difference in it? Because I'm not too sure. But at least. At least I think that the build on Water Cannon Girl is not brilliant. She was kind of quickly thrown together. It's because the game froze. It kind of... It was buffering real bad. It was just giving me all types of issues. So I threw something on her. Which I thought would have worked. Clearly never. But again, slow progress in Dungeons is progress. And... I think we're, we're on the right page 
I think it's just the runes. So what to do is, because I'm exhausted, I think I'm just going to go to sleep. Stick a comment, uh, stick a comment down below, good or bad, if I suck, just let rip. Constructive criticism is just as good as praise. Anything helps. Yeah, until tomorrow night, guys. I love you all. Take care. See you soon.